Covering news where you live. Five News starts with breaking news. And our response teams are doing everything in our power to rescue and recover the victims of this collapse literally as we speak. Right now, the search for survivors continues in Baltimore after a massive cargo ship slams into the Francis Scott Key Bridge earlier this morning. Right now, we're learning that at least six people remain unaccounted for. The collapse sent construction workers and possibly vehicles into the water. Two people were rescued. Ryan Hughes has the latest from Baltimore County. Video shows the moment a cargo ship plowed into the Francis Scott Key Bridge. CBS News has confirmed the massive container ship lost propulsion before impact. The entire bridge, the entire key bridge in the harbor. We know there were individuals on the bridge at the time of the collapse working on the bridge. Now the Coast Guard and other agencies are racing to find possible survivors. In addition to workers on the bridge, video shows multiple vehicles on the span. And our response teams are doing everything in our power to rescue and recover the victims of this collapse literally as we speak. The 974 foot cargo ship called the Dolly left Baltimore Harbor about 20 minutes before the crash. At one point, crew members on board notified state officials that the ship had lost propulsion and that hitting the bridge was possible. But we're thankful that between the May Day and the collapse that uh, that we had officials who were able to to begin to stop the flow of traffic. Video shows most of the lights on the ship going out just before the accident. The steering system on a um, on a ship like this is hydraulically powered. And so when you lose electrical power, you're going to lose the, the hydraulics. Of course, the rudder is uh, hydraulically powered. Officials say the workers on the bridge were repairing potholes. A facility has been set up with mental health professionals for family members to deal with this tragedy. Ryan Hughes, CBS News, Baltimore County, Maryland.